What's up? It's that metal guy, 1983, and tonight I'm coming to you with a beer review for Naninsky Brewing Company. I hope that's how you pronounce it. This is part of their goat variety pack. This is the Juicy Dominion Tropical IPA. What else can I tell you about these fellers? 12 blue ounces. Alcohol per volume is 6.3%, 40 on the ABVs. Sink your feet into a crisp golden sand. Can you smell it? Juicy Dominion, swirling riptide of papaya, orange, and guava notes, bursting all around that finishes smooth with velvety. Just like your favorite tropical adventure. Alrighty then. Let's see if I can make out where they're... Eugene, Oregon. So yeah, that's not too far out. That's right there, them there in Oregon. Yeah, buddy. Now, let's crack this open. I've never tried this one before. So, actually, this is a brand new brewery to me, believe it or not. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Oh, yeah. The Nakasi, however you pronounce it. If I'm butchering it, I'm sorry. My bad. If you know, correct me down in the comments below. And speaking of that, while you're here, subscribe to the channel. Tell your other beard-loving friends about this channel. And hey, if they love beer and they have a beard and they want to be able to take care of it and maintain it, check me out for that reason too. Subscribe to the channel. Give it a thumbs up, high five, very nice, and then comment down below because I love talking to you guys. So, definitely get those tropical fruits from the nose and in the taste. Uh, it has that love, you know, we all love that IPA hoppiness, but... Not a whole bunch out of orange out of that as it listed on here. Um, what I am getting more of is the guava and papaya emphasis. More for me on the guava and then papaya and then orange is kind of thirdly in the profile. Hmm. Not a bad first impression of this company. Um, excited to dive into more. I've got one variety pack of the goat and another variety pack that is in bottles, um, which is three different IPAs and then one Pilsner. I'm not a huge Pilsner person, but if you're doing craft Pilsners, that I think may be on another level, not just the standard run-of-the-mill flagship stuff that's mass-produced. So... Mm -hmm. Cheers. Today is Monday. What is it? Today the 6th of April. Holy smokes. It's already the 6th of April. This weekend's freaking Easter. I mean, time is flying by in quarantine time. And holy crap, I'm going stir crazy. I hate staying inside all the time. We're going on little walks. And all that jazz, um, the kiddo, uh, <laughs> when I went to go pick her up, we were rocking out in the car, 
I put that on live on Instagram. Uh, on the way back, we all said, hell yeah. And windows down, she's on the back. <laughs> you know, Daddy Junior right there. Any hooser, hope everyone's staying sane, staying healthy. Also, we have all the time in the world, since a lot of us are stuck inside, find a new hobby, revisit an old one, find a new hustle. Uh, I've been working out every single morning and sometimes in the afternoons. Um, I'm not going to let the quarantine get me. I'm going to own this mofo and I'm going to come out the other side of it sexy AF. Oh, yeah. Cheers. Yeah. So there's the can again. Like a floating flying saucer, anyway. Yeah. Keep on rocking. Oh, yeah.